Hello my lovely supporters. I hope you're doing really well. Today I'm here to share with you my mom's beef curry recipe. Let's start cooking. You will have to add some cooking oil in a pot. Once the oil is heated, add your onions. Then when the onions have softened, add the holy spices in here. So I've got three cinnamon sticks, five cardamoms, four bay leaves, one star anise, five cloves, one teaspoon of fenugreek seeds. Mom says when you add fenugreek seeds, it adds more taste. After sorting the onion, add your meat. Here I'm using two kilos of meat. Stir and let it sit for 10 minutes. Then add two teaspoon of ginger, two teaspoon of garlic and salt to taste. Let that sit for another 10 minutes before adding your spices. Now I'm going to add all the spices. So here it is, one and a half teaspoon of turmeric powder, one and a half teaspoon of cumin powder, one tablespoon of chili powder, one and a half teaspoons of coriander powder, half teaspoon of garam masala, one teaspoon of paprika powder, half teaspoon of black pepper, quarter teaspoon of nutmeg powder, and add one teaspoon of curry powder. Then give it a good mix. The meat pieces are now perfectly combined with the spices. Now I'm going to add two chopped tomatoes and half of a pepper. Stir, then cover until the tomatoes have softened. Now add a quarter cup of yogurt, one teaspoon of tomato puree, one teaspoon of poppy seeds and nut paste. You can use any nuts you want, but I'm using almond. Combine everything together and cook for seven to eight minutes. Now add one liter of water and bring it to boil. After you bring it to boil, add one teaspoon of curry powder. I forgot to add it with the spices, so I'm doing it now. Cover it for 35 to 40 minutes until the meat is tender. After 40 minutes, take the lid out and let it sit for a bit more until the water has reduced. Now add your green chilies and garnish it with fresh chopped corianders. I really hope that you enjoyed watching this video today. If you have, then please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family.